Hello there, everybody. Welcome on into today's video. Greatly appreciate you taking time out of your day. So I'm going to check her on out because we have part two of uh, 21 throwback series. Some more MVs for you. Um, decided same shirt as the previous video because, you know, I got down work early. So I'm just kind of gremlin status recording session because uh, I have a very busy week at work. And then I'm going to be traveling to go see Idol. So here we are. This is it. The last of the MVs for now, for now, for now, for now. I mean, it's not going to be like the last forever uh, for them because I really, really liked part one. Um, those MVs were really good uh, as well as the songs. Fantastic. Now, don't forget, these are the ones that you recommended to me. So uh, thank you all for giving me great suggestions. You guys gave me a lot, so it was hard to kind of like narrow down to eight uh, because according to a lot of you, they did a lot of MVs for their B-sides. So I was like, <laughs> okay. Um, so these are just ones that uh, popped up quite frequently within the recommendations over on the community tab, as well as in the Discord. So thank you again. But today we do have um, ugly, I love you, missing you, and come back home. Those are the four MVs and songs we'll be listening to and watching. So, yeah, no news, no news. Um, so with that being said, we're just going to just jump right into it because uh, I just want to watch these. Let's go. Let's do this. I don't think there's any CCs. Let me check. No, no CCs. The big womp womp right there. All right, four minutes. See, this is what I'm saying. All of the, the like, the earlier generation MVs are so much longer than the ones now. Damn. Okay. All right. Four four minutes and thirty three seconds. Let's do this. So cool. Vocals are so good. Ooh, got some rock in here. Let's go. Okay. I was not expecting a little bit of rock in this. I'm all 
hope that note. I said, I was not expecting a little bit of rockin' beat in this song. Jeez, okay. switching to this. I was not expecting a little bit of a rock beat in there. Okay. Wow, they've been giving me everything. But like R&B and like hip hop. Some like synth type beats in there. And now rock? Damn. Okay. Like, was that a B-side song? Was that a title track? I don't fucking know. Could have been title track. Sound like a title track. Oh my word. I can see why they're so popular too. Why you all were like, please. Now. Oh god. I like that song. I you I mean You saw my Dreamcatcher, Deep Dev. Yeah, I like the rock. I like the rock beats a lot great when you feel like there's no way out love is the only way What's this fucking be what the hell I love her voice. I love her rap style. They're all so good. Even hers, too. I like hers, too.
note. Let's go. vocals are fantastic what so we went from like this weird like not weird it wasn't weird it was just like this rock beat to this and i just have questions on how we got here um is this what the b-sides are gonna like whiplash me a little bit am i gonna get whiplashed on the b-sides i feel like i am Oh no. Oh gosh. Okay. All right. Yeah. I, no, I really like that song. I sucker for a good house beat. A little synth, synth pop. Yes, please. Um, I love that genre. So, yeah, give me that. Hell yeah. Let's go. <clears throat> Ooh, the harmony. What are these outfits? What are these outfits? Ooh. <laughs> this is going to be popping. It sounds like bubbles. Hair's crazy, I love it. Yes, I love her tone. Oh, What is this like popping in this beat? Oh. 
Harmonies are insane. What the hell? What was that popping? My ear. What? What was that? There was like this, like randomly, just like this weird, like, like popping beat. It almost sounded like bubbles. It was really weird. But it was, I don't know. And then switching to the piano. Why? But oh my word, their harmonies are so good especially at the beginning of the song oh shit <laughs> what oh god oh god oh god oh god i'm so sad that they're they're you know disbanded here we are here we are these are being fantastic guys thank you for recommending these um, this one was, this one was also a very, like, popular recommendation, was Missing You. I can see why. I love the harmonies in that. What? Okay, right, hold on. Before we even start this, this looks futuristic. Okay, great. Um, the... <laughs> Their concepts are out of this world, too. I've gotten so many different things. Oh, gosh. This is a more recent one, 2014. Okay. It's almost like nine years ago. It's fine. Do we have CCs, though? No. Still no. Still no. It's all right. Still enjoying. Okay. Virtual Paradise. Okay. Is this... Like harassed too. No, like, I cannot all of them. all of them. Don't 
love this for a fan. It's fantastic. I love it. This <laughs> drop is it like I was not expecting it. <laughs> Oh, that was the end. Okay, okay. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Oh, what? I've gotten so, so many different genres in a way, like mixed in with each other. There was like some weird underlining reggae beat at the beginning of that song. And then all of a sudden we got into like a synth pop house beat with a drop. The, the, that actually might be one of my favorites from like this, these eight. That and Missing You. Both of those. Fantastic. Absolutely love. I mean, I'm adding all of them to a playlist. They were all really good, but... If I had to like kind of narrow it down a little bit, I think, I think that one might be, I don't, I don't know. There's just something about it. And then the harmonies and like missing you. Oh boy. Oh boy. What are these B-sides going to sound like? I've gotten hip hop. I've gotten like a little bit of reggae. I've gotten a little bit of rock from ugly. Um, I got synth pop. Got some synth. A little house beat? What? Dance pop-ish? Why? Okay. All right. And this is just the tip of the iceberg here. I still have a whole, like, I think there's like nine, eight or nine songs on the, on the B-sides. I'll be, I'm going to be filming that in the next couple of days. Oh boy. All right. Well. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I really I'm like this makes so hearing this stuff now makes me sad that I that I didn't get into K-pop like earlier in life, like 10 years ago. Man, what a time that this would have been like, um, like, it's amazing now. But just to have this stuff like like 10 years ago would have been fucking fantastic. And like same with like Girls Generation 2, like, man, bat, like discovering k-pop so so much later i'm like i've missed out on so much but we're discovering it now guys we're discovering it now it's the whole point of this throwback series to discover these so i can learn about the these groups that are you know second gen and early like third gen groups um man some of the difference though i'm like seeing these i'm seeing okay so hear me out before we wrap this up Seeing the, the like, Girls' Generation 21 Cosmic Girls so far, like, those three, seeing those and then seeing some of this newer stuff, man, there's such a fucking difference. <laughs> In, like, just style, everything. There's a, a few, like, there's several groups that still have, like, this kind of, like, feel to it, but a lot of it is just, no. It is not this, and this is, like, this is, fucking good like really good 
Damn, okay, I'm gonna be adding so much, so much songs to my playlist. My playlist is gonna be like 300 songs. I have like one master playlist and then I have like individual like playlists that I like add stuff to. But like my master playlist that I have, I think Ari has like over 300 songs just based off of like everything that I've been listening to. So what the hell? It's just gonna be so long. It's gonna be like three days worth of music that you would never repeat. It's gonna be fucking fantastic. Um... Yeah, no, thank you guys for recommending these. I thoroughly enjoyed them. Like I said, I really do think I am missing you. Uh, come back home. Some of my favorites from this right now. Um, I definitely will be listening to the others uh, more. I'll be adding those to a couple of playlists to, to re-listen to. But so far, those are my two top faves. And then we'll get to the B-sides and then who fucking knows. Um, but yeah, no, hopefully you guys have a great rest of your day. Thank you for joining me. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed the video and I will catch you on that next one. Later.